Hi guys, welcome back to Kippy Up with it. This is your third dog and this is mine. Okay, so today, today this is the food we have. This is an instant noodle or we call pad mi and crispy pork. Pad mi? Yes, pad mi. And crispy pork? Yes, and we have luchin, you see, small ball. Oh, luchin, yeah, those yeah, are the little luchin. pork balls. Yes, exactly. And, and they, you pound them mm -hmm. in the pork pork and make them like a, yeah. like a meatball. Uh -huh. And then if we have Ooh. in the isan pad mi or rao pad mi, we choose to have kalakaya salad. Green papaya salad. Mm, but it is isan. This is isan mm. style. You'll see a Man. lot of chili peppers. And you want me to call out what's my key? Sometimes I look up. Pat me, Naka. Sometimes you put uh, shrimp or crab. I know, but this time I don't want to put the crab on. <laughs> It's kind of like a... Fresh water crab. Yeah, I know that it's this time. But you know, today is a special day. We will not only show you guys about we eating, we will talking about how we meet also, right? Because when we travel and people just ask the question, how you guys meet, how you guys meet? Because I from Thailand and my husband live in America. So, but before we talking about that, I want to eat food because Please. I'm so hungry. Okay? Me too. Okay. This is kind of spicy. You will be like a... When, when Thai person says oh, spicy, <laughs> they mean chili pepper hot burn your mouth. They call it spicy. So, yes, it's spicy. Yes, I put a lot of chili pepper on this. Just see. Oh, I believe mm. how I'm doing it. Mm. You know, you eat it the more spicy than my parent. <laughs> yeah, not, not every Thai person likes Spicy. Hot, spicy food. Yeah. We, mom, we think we think like all Thai people not eat. like spicy. Food. And some my enemies that they not eat spicy. But you know, right? Uh, I from Ban Nong Tae, and Ban Nong Tae is like that. We are go around of chili pepper. And he bought some stuff. Me, na kha wa. Ah, ki Ban Nong Tae, ของเราเนี่ยเดี๋ยวก็อยู่ที่บ้านหนองแต้นะคะก็คือเราปลูกพริกค่อนข้างเยอะเพราะที่นั่นคนที่นั่นก็ค่อนข้างที่จะกินเผ็ดนะคะเป็นสาวอีสานนี่ส่วนวันนี้นะคะเราก็จะกินนี่เลยส้มตำนะคะหมูกรอบแล้วก็ผัดหมี่หลังจากกินเสร็จเนี่ยเดี๋ยวเราก็จะมาบอกทุกคนนะคะว่าเราเจอกันได้อย่างไรอย่าทางเสื้อผ้าเสื้อ for everybody and this is we eat this a lot this is a pork belly exactly and uh, and you cook it many different ways mm -hmm. and fry it and boil it and then fry it and dry it. You do many, many different ways. But in America, it's hard to get because we have bacon, mm -hmm. but bacon has too many flavors mm -hmm. in it. This is just pork belly, just the fat. Mm -hmm. and now we know where to find it in the U.S., but very yeah. popular in Thailand. It's so good. Mm. I love my papaya uh, Did we just get from Costco? Yeah, Costco has good yeah. pork belly. And Not bacon, pork belly. Pork belly yeah. No no spice, no flavor, no mm -hmm. salt, just meat. And the pie is so good also, you know. And these are the Lu, Lu Chin, mm -hmm. Lu Chin ball. Mm -hmm. These are <laughs> Thai style where you, you mince the meat in, mm -hmm. the, in the mortar and pestle, pok pok. Mm -hmm. And uh, what else you put in to make it? Uh, I put scarlet. Garlic, salt, salt, pepper, pepper. You put in egg. I need no. I need a bit sugar for mm -hmm. make the taste. And then you pound it. Yeah, and, and, and then you make a little ball. Yeah, and then just like a meat ball. in the water. And and then you boil it in the water. Yeah. You don't put in the oil. No, after boil and then fry in the oil. Yeah. After you boil it, mm -hmm. then you put in the oil. Sometimes they make them out of fish. Mm hmm. Man. But I like pork. Mm hmm. So good. I think pork is number one meat in Isan, right? Yeah, in Isan, not in Thailand fish, also. Beef, but pork, number pork one. Pork number one and chicken number two for Thai people. And then beef is that. Not much beef. <laughs> not much beef because the Thai people think about beef in Thailand is smelly stuff. So. <laughs> yeah, they don't like the smell, but they like the smell of durian. 
It smells pretty strong. So when I get a big chili pepper, I give this to my lovely Envy. wife because she likes that. We have been spousal. Oh. Now the other thing mm -hmm. you see in Thailand, mm -hmm. when they make the food, there's always a raw vegetables. Here we have bean sprouts, cabbage, mm -hmm. bok choy. What's that? Why, why, why do you do that? Because it's uh, some Thai people, we just uh, eat like a salad, you know, we just we can eat like this. So you eat raw? Yeah. No sauce, no dressing. Just yeah. Very raw. And then it's a uh, many people like different, right? If you not eat bean sprout, you just eat cabbage. And if you not like the cabbage, just eat bean sprout. Uh, bean sprout and, and all in the bok choy. And eat with, or if you not like eating. Do you eat the bok choy? I don't think I like bok choy. Bok choy is good. good for cook. It's good. But it's like now just for decoration for making beautiful. That's another secret. In Thailand, you have to know the difference between decoration and food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you might have to be careful. Sometimes they put the karingo in the soup, but not me. You can eat the karingo. The first thing I learned in Thailand, <laughs> you, just because it's in the soup bowl doesn't mean you eat it. Mm -hmm. You have to pick out the things like the fish or the prawns or the meat or the vegetable, the wow. mushroom. But leave the gallon go and the pepper. And you know, papaya salad is really spicy for me. Oh, even for you. Mm -hmm. I think because you eat too much American food, yep. you're losing your your isan. But it tastes so good. I also like. Me, yeah. I also like the Thai style eating. Mm -hmm. The Thais eat with the spoon, and the fork is just for pushing mm -hmm. the food. Onto the spoon. Yep, just like that. And you put yep. on the spoon everything you want. Like a luchin, mm -hmm. some noodle. Lady. Maybe I put a little green papaya and then eat it. Mmm. Mm -hmm. You're a good cook. You cook good. Mm -hmm. Where'd you learn to cook? Did your mother teach you? No. No? Not really. How'd you learn? Because you're a good cook. You know, you I mean just you make many things. Learn from me the when it, I learn from the arguing, from the people, from the fan, from the uh, social media, from the YouTube. YouTube. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, many things. So you're in many a, way. So you're you're a YouTube type cook. Mm-hmm. Okay, after we clean the table now. We will talking how we meet. I know everybody want to know. <laughs> so they do. Yeah, everybody want to know. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe, maybe they not want to know. Okay, so how we meet? Yeah. Do you remember? No. <laughs> it's a long time ago. Yes, like how many years ago? Four. Five. Five years. Yes, like well, a prior year. Yeah, we're married almost one year. Mm -hmm. In a couple of days, few days. But we meet four years before. Uh huh. Well, you know, when I was a boy, I lived in Thailand. I, yeah. I lived there when, in the 60s, mm -hmm. maybe 50 years ago. I went to high school. Uh huh. Lived on Soi Klong, Soi 49, uh -huh. off Sukhumvit, right by the canal, the Klong. Okay. And I used to take the boat to school. <clears throat> but I never, I never went back to Thailand after I left when I was a boy. Uh huh. And after I retired, I started to scuba dive. I wanted to scuba dive. And I started to research where to go scuba dive, best place to get classes. And guess what? Mm -hmm. Thailand was one of the best places to go scuba diving to get school mm -hmm. and get your certification. So I decided to go back to Thailand to go yeah. scuba diving. After I finished scuba diving on Koh Tao, wonderful. And then we, we went later, but... This time I went alone. Mm -hmm. I came back to Bangkok. I had to go back to the United States the next day. And I thought, I really like Thailand. I remembered it. It was wonderful. The people were mm -hmm. great. The country's wonderful. So interesting. So I said, I think maybe I meet a Thai girl. And then next time I come, we can uh, go to Thailand together. 
No, we go to in the we meet in the website. No, no, I'm saying I was thinking about in the future I would meet someone. Uh -huh. So how to meet a person yeah. in Thailand? I only have one more day, uh -huh. so I Google Thai dating site okay. you know, to date to okay. find a girl, yes. and I found one. And okay. I look through the website. I must say, I think most of the profiles were prostitutes. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So I need I need to translate for in the Thai people first. เดี๋ยวก็จะแปลให้ฟังนะคะก็คือคุณสามีเนี่ยตอนที่เขาอายุ16นะคะในส่วนของครอบครัวเขาเนี่ยแล้วก็ในส่วนของพ่อแล้วก็แม่นะคะเขาก็อยู่ที่ไทยนะคะเพราะว่าเป็นในส่วนของครอบครัวของทหารอเมริกันนะคะที่อยู่ในไทยแล้วก็เขาก็เรียนอ่าโรงเรียนเนี่ยเป็นโรงเรียนมัธยมนะคะที่ไทยที่สคุมวิทซอยคองเยสซอยคองเดียโฟร์ที่นายนะคะซึ่งเขาก็มีบ้านอยู่ที่นั่นประมาณ2ปีนะคะหลังจากนั้นเนี่ยเขาก็เลยอยากจะกลับไปนะคะเพื่อเป็นการลำลึกความหลังเกี่ยวกับที่เคยอยู่ไทยนั่นแหละก็เป็นถือว่าเป็นฝรั่งกลุ่มแรกๆนะคะที่อยู่ไทยตั้งแต่ถนนสุขุมวิทเนี่ยมีเพียงแค่2เส้นนะคะจนปัจจุบันนี้คิดดูเอาว่าบีซี่ขนาดไหนนะคะแล้วก็หลังจากนั้นนะคะก็กลับไปแล้วก็ไปดำน้ำไปอะไรหลายๆอย่างนั่นแหละแล้วเขาก็เลยอยากจะเจอนะคะเจอก็คือเจอแบบคนไทยที่แบบจะหาคู่อะไรเงี้ยเขาก็เลยแบบหาในเว็บไซต์นะคะโอเค so then after that you so go you, to website and you look through it and you can see very sexy pictures <coughs> but maybe uh -huh. some some of the girls women uh -huh. were business women very traditional yeah. nice clothes you know just beautiful pictures with their family in their village very uh -huh. nice and then I saw your picture yeah you were Absolutely beautiful. Ooh, thank you, Michael. And you were, the, <laughs> of course. And you were the you were I, I didn't know, but you were the HR director for a big manufacturing company, and mm -hmm. you had nice clothes on, business suit, business dinners. No, and I said, "Sami Jay is the Sami Jay I sit next to the Buddha." Okay, I need to translate. หลังจากนั้นนะคะคุณสามีเนี่ยเขาก็เข้าไปในเว็บไซต์หาคู่นะคะแล้วก็ไปเจอนี่ในเว็บไซต์And A. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. I send you a message saying, mm -hmm. "Oh, you look so nice. A uh, very interesting profile. Mm -hmm. Would you like to meet?" I'm only in Bangkok one more day. Mm -hmm. And I send you a message. Yeah. And then you want you want to know why on i n d a s website? Well, yeah. Well, <laughs> I was happy you were on the website. Uh, yeah. But I what I didn't know is you were getting ready to quit. So you can. Tell. Yes. Okay. That's the reason. Is so I will tell uh, you guys why on the website because you know I just uh, get the broke from is my e g is a bad Thai boyfriend and then I just feel so lonely and then I just go to the website and the one thing when I go to in the the website for in the dating the one thing I see a lot of the crazy is <laughs> men try to send message. For me, same as you when you in the website, and then you in the see like um, the girl try to make money, try to take you because everything and the same as me when I in in that website like crazy is the people is the many many, and then the last the last is the message I get is from you because I will quit that from the website because I just think oh I will stop. Stop for in the find someone for being the boyfriend about love, and I just want to concentrate about my business, and I want to concentrate about in the how to make the money. That yeah. yeah. that is okay. I need to translate for in the Thai people. ก็คือในส่วนของของเบลเองเนี่ยนะคะตอนที่เข้าไปในส่วนของเว็บไซต์หาคู่เนี่ยตอนนั้นเราก็เริ่มกับแฟนคนไทยนั่นแหละนะคะก็เลยแบบจะหาประสบการณ์ใหม่ๆเราก็เลยเข้าไปในเว็บไซต์เป็นเว็บไซต์หาคู่แต่สิ่งที่เราไปเจอเนี่ยก็คือเป็นในส่วนของแบบฝรั่งที่แบบส่งข้อความมาแล้วก็แบบว่า18บวกในเชิงลบอะไรเงี้ยอยากเพียงแค่แบบว่าจะแบบยังไงเนี่ยก็คือแบบคือแบบแค่เจอแล้วก็ไปนอนด้วยแล้วก็กลับบ้านอะไรประมาณเนี้ยแล้วก็ในส่วนของคุณสามีที่เข้าไปเจออะไรเงี้ยในในเว็บไซต์ก็จะเป็นประมาณว่าก็เจอแบบผู้หญิงขายตัวค่อนข้างเยอะอะไรอย่างเงี้ยค่ะแต่ว่าในส่วนของเบลเองเนี่ยก็คือก่อนที่จะเจอเขาเนี่ยก็คือเราจะเข้าไปแล้วก็จะปิดเว็บไซต์นั่นแหละเพราะว่าในส่วนของเบลเองก็ทํางานแล้วก็เลยจะจะแบบว่าโฟกัสในเรื่องของงานมากกว่าในเรื่องของการทําธุรกิจก็คือแบบว่าโอ้ฉันยอมแพ้แล้วฉันคงจะไม่มีผัวแล้วในเวลานั้นนะคะจนกระทั่ง
่าได้แบบในส่วนของคุณสามีเนี่ยเขาก็ส่งข้อความทักทายมา then in that time they just the same message and say hi to me yes. and then we start to talking yeah we we did messages mm-hmm. back and forth back and, and, and and then we agreed that mm-hmm. we would meet for dinner that yes. night And I didn't know Bangkok very well mm-hmm. because it had changed so much. So I was staying on Sukhumvit, uh-huh. somewhere around Soi 20, uh-huh. in a nice hotel mm-hmm. close to the BTS. And the only place I knew for sure was Terminal 21 uh-huh. at the o l s o k BTS. That's yes. the subway, elevated subway station, yes. right on Sukhumvit. There was a nice modern uh, shopping center yes, with cool like six, one. I think six stories all mm-hmm. the way up, and uh, I knew on the first floor was a Victoria's Secret mm-hmm. shop. So I said, "I'll meet you six o'clock in front of the Victoria mm-hmm. Secret station uh, shop on uh, yes. Terminal 21. โอเค I would need to translate หลังจากนั้นนะคะหลังจากที่เราแบบคุณสามีส่งเมสเซจให้เราก็คุยกันสักพักหนึ่งนั่นแหละนะคะหลังจากนั้นเราก็นัดเจอกันที่เทอร์มินอลทเวนตี้วันนะคะเพราะว่าในส่วนของเขาเองเนี่ยเขาก็ไม่ค่อยรู้รู้ในเรื่องของพื้นที่กรุงเทพมากสักเท่าไหร่เพราะว่าก่อนหน้านี้ในช่วงเวลาที่เขาอยู่เนี่ยตอนอายุสิบหกปีเนี่ยก็เป็นช่วงที่แบบว่ามันก็ค่อนข้างนาน What year you in the and your parents stay in Bangkok 1967 to 60, <laughs> Ever, you know, they have a fence. But uh, I remember uh, what I didn't know, mm-hmm. but you never said anything. Was I basically asked you to meet me yes. at the hardest place for someone to drive a car? I know because you have a car. Oh. All you had to do was tell I me. I just take me in. <laughs> you should have just told me no. to go out on the BTS station somewhere easy. But I didn't know. But so you drove all the way in. Yeah. And then we met, and uh, I remember you had. We went upstairs to the Japanese restaurant, mm-hmm. and I had the crispy soft shell crab, and you and had I salmon. salmon. Oh. Yeah. หลังจากนั้นเราก็ไปเจอกันที่เทอร์มินอลทเวนตี้วันนะคะแล้วก็ในส่วนของคุณสามีเนี่ยเขาก็สั่งเป็นในส่วนของปูที่เป็นแบบปูแบบปูนิ่มนะคะแบบทอดกรอบส่วนนี้ก็ salmon. Yeah. And then I learned something that's very important. If you're interested in dating a Thai, mm-hmm. was you spoke English? You could speak English, good English, and Me? so yeah. No, no that's no, how is I know you, very good. But you understood English. Yeah, I so, understand. So I was able to to easily talk to you, uh-huh, and we started exactly. to learn a lot more. Uh-huh. I think it would. Be a lot harder if you didn't know English exactly. and I didn't know Thai. We had to learn together, but there you were. You spoke and understood English perfect. So yes, and uh, and then I had a wonderful time. This is me and too. The, and the first, and then I got on the airplane. As I'm leaving the airplane, I'm thinking. I have to come back to Thailand. Oh, this <laughs> is bad. okay. This is a guy a s k story about how we meet. But the one thing I will tell you, if you go to in the d e t someone in website, you must be careful. Be careful. Yes, me too. Because I in the farm in the Thailand, I is lady. Then sometimes I go in the website. If you are in the ready, you must be careful because some man is dangerous for you also. Crazy yeah. people. Not just only women. <laughs> it's the men. นะคะก็ฝากไว้นะคะสำหรับใครที่จะหาแฟนหรือว่าหาคู่เนี่ยในส่วนของเว็บไซต์นะคะเราก็ต้องระวังเพราะว่ามันก็มีทั้งในส่วนของคนดีแล้วก็คนไม่ดีในส่วนของเบลเองเนี่ยก่อนที่จะเจอสามีเนี่ยเราก็จะบอกว่ายังไงอ่ะก็เจอแบบค่อนข้างที่จะแบบว่าเลวร้ายก็ก็ค่อนข้างเยอะอะไรเงี้ยนะคะก็มีทั้งดีทั้งไม่ดีกว่าที่จะได้ได้หรือว่าแบบประสบอ่าในเรื่องของการที่แบบว่าได้สามีเนี่ยมันก็ไม่ใช่เรื่องง่ายเนาะก็คือมันก็แล้วแต่ดวงแล้วแต่ว่าใครจะเป็นคู่ของกันและกันนะคะก่อนหน้านี้เบลก็เจอหลายคนก็มีแบบไม่ดีก็เยอะอะไรอย่างเงี้ยแบบมาแบบบ้าๆบอๆอะไรเงี้ยก็ก็เยอะเราก็ต้องเลือกเอาเนาะ
Okay. Yes, you must have to be careful. You might have to in the Lawang Noi. Yes, this is. Okay. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoy and like our video. If you like it, yes, please give the thumb up. Okay, and be sure to subscribe and follow us because we will have uh, interesting about our story and we'll tell you about the secret in snake video. Please subscribe and follow us if you want to know. Okay, see you guys. Bye bye. bye, -bye.